Assalamu alaikum and uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to show you how to do a proper exothermic welding with the four way dies. In this video, we are using 150 RM bare copper conductors and to join these bare copper conductors we are using exothermic welding this dark box is called dice to press the dice we are using a pressing tool before doing the exothermic welding we have to clean this bare copper conductors in order to clean this bare copper conductor we have used a steel brush it is very much needed to clean these conductors now we are compressing these soils around the dies so that it can stop the leakage of the welding this welding is uh, very much efficient and uh, it takes very much uh, it takes less time to do a welding it's a very uh, it's a one kind of most efficient way to do welding in a short time this video has been taken from a capacitor bank project as per the project we have to do mesh arthi for the mesh arthi we are using this isothermic welding so now our dice is ready to put the gunpowder now we are going to insert the gunpowder into the dice so this is this chamber is for the explosion can, we can call it as an uh, explosion chamber now we are inserting the gunpowder the ratio of the gunpowder is also very much important so we have to be careful on that To make the fire, we are using some marches sticks. In this video, this uh, soil was not properly compressed. Now we are going to make the fire. And it's an explosive material and it's an explosion. So we have to be very much careful. The temperature of the dice is now very much high. So do not touch the dice with your bare skin. It will burn your skin, literally. So you have to be careful in, on that. Now we are going to remove the dice. If you, uh, if we don't remove the dice on time, uh, it will stuck. So that is how a exothermic welding was done. See, there is some leakage due to not proper compressing soil. Thank you.